All right, what we have here is the PetSafe Wireless Pet Containment Receiver Collar. This particular one, as you can see here, is the RSCIF275. Um, this is really important because this particular one can be used with the wireless unit, which is the one that does not have the underground wires. It's really important to know because if you're adding another uh, collar, replacing one, you have to make sure you get the right model number. So this particular one does have the three adjustable levels, the low battery indicator, which is right here. If you can see, there you go. Right there, this will flash red when the battery's dying. Waterproof, and it has a one-year warranty. Um, you can see the collars all come red like this. Um, it's also one of those things where once you uh, uh, unpackage it, you do have to sync it with your unit, and I'll show you how to do that as well. Okay, so we're doing a quick video on this uh, wireless collar here with PetSafe. Uh, what you want to do is once you get your uh, battery installed, um, you're gonna ha you're gonna sync it. So make sure it's close to the unit, and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this boundary control here, and you're gonna put it all the way down to number one. Now I know you can't see the numbers, but there's numbers on side on the side. So just scroll it all the way to the to the bottom. So you've got a low and a high. If you want to have a long range, you put it to high. You want to have a short range, you want to make sure it's on low. Make sure it's got power. And then with the collar close, you just slowly set the range. So if you put it all the way to number 9, that's obviously the far furthest diameter that the uh, animal can roam. But you can back it down to like number 7, and then it will shorten that diameter. But the point is, when you put in a new battery, make sure that you slowly roll this up to whatever boundary that you want. Alright, so if you ever have to replace a battery, uh, these are proprietary batteries. You, what you want to do is see these slots? You basically want to do something, like a screwdriver, a coin, and pull this out. And that's what it's going to look like. Get a new one, and then once you put it in, you'll see that... Um, there are kind of uh, two little grooves right here. And you're going to line them up with the grooves inside here and put in a new battery. It's very simple. 